Thank you for coming to the YouTube channel, Mr. Professor or Kyosu Aje in Korean. In this video, we're going to talk about the Kormang number of a Kinesi graph. More precisely, we're going to show an upper bound for the Kormang number of a Kinesi graphs. So what is a Kinesi graph? Given two positive integers, A and B, such that A is greater than or equal to 2B, the vertex set of the Kinesi graph, written Kg A comma B, is the collection of all B sets from the A set. For example, A is equal to 5 and B is equal to 2, then you can think about two sets from five sets. So one, two, one, three, one, four, one, five, and two, three, two, four, two, five, three, four, three, five, and four, five. All those two sets are considered as vertices and how to give an edge between two vertices. So if two vertices are disjoint, then edge. For example, you can think about the one, two. So this vertex, and you can think about three, four, okay, this vertex. And you can see one, two, this set, and the three, four, this set, disjoint, disjoint. So we can give an edge between them like this. However, if you consider one, three, this two set, and one, two, and one, three, you can see there is one in common. So not disjoint. So we don't give an edge between those two. Okay, so our goal is to show that the chromic number of a Kinesi graph is at most a minus 2b plus 2. What does this mean? So probably you want to partition the vertex set into a minus 2b plus 2 set. Say v sub 1 through v sub a minus 2b plus 2 such that, okay, for each i, okay, included in a minus 2b plus 2, <clears throat> v sub i is independent. Because v sub i is independent, so you can assign 1 to v sub 1, and you can assign 2 to v sub 2, right? So actually, we can color the vertex set V sub I with the color just I. By the choice of V sub I, V sub I is just independent. So we can assign the color I to the vertex set. So we have no problem. And how can we have the vertex partition with A minus 2B plus 2 set? So in the previous step here, okay, when a is equal to five and b is equal to two, okay? Well, so look at the first four sets, okay? All those four, two sets include one. Then we can assign one. And the next one, All those two sets include two as a minimum element, right? So then we can assign two like that. And the remaining those two sets, we assign three, okay? Then actually when A is equal to five and B is equal to two, Okay, we can have a vertex partition with the three sets. But these three sets actually see A is equal to five and here, and B is equal to two. 
Yeah, so that is exactly equal to just the three. So we show that the chromatic number of the Kinesi graph when A is equal to five and B is equal to two is at most three. Okay, so okay, we can do similarly. So for each I, okay, in uh, one through A minus two B plus one, we define V sub I as the collection of uh, all B sets having I as the minimum element, like the previous one. Okay, look at, the, look at here. So in this case, uh, the minimum is one and this one is minimum is a two like that, okay. Okay, so now we have actually uh, A minus two B plus one set in here. Okay, but the, our goal is to show that we want to have a vertex partition with A minus two B plus two sets, right? So in the remaining part, okay, except the vertices in V sub I, okay, for I is uh, 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 between one and A minus two B plus one, okay, all the other B sets, okay, we are going to put all the other B sets, okay, put it here put into uh, V sub A minus 2B plus 2. Okay, so it is easy to see that the V sub I is independent for I is between one and A minus 2B plus one because for each I, the all the B elements in V sub I includes I. So they are, they are not disjoint, so we don't give an edge, okay? But look at V sub A minus 2B plus 2. So actually, we already coupled all the B sets, okay, the, as minimum so A minus 2B plus 1. So now look at a set of V sub A minus 2B plus 2, okay? So A minus, oh, sorry, A minus 2B plus 2 and up to and A. And now we want to collect all the B sets. Okay, all, so the V sub A minus 2B plus 2 is the collection of all B sets from here. But how many elements in here? So you, if you subtract in here, then actually we have a 2B minus 1 element in here. What does this mean? This means that if you, if you collect two B sets from here, then they are always share a common element, which means that they cannot be disjoint. So we don't give an edge in here. So that means V sub A minus 2B plus 2 is also an independent set. Okay. So we partition the vertex set of Kinesi graph AB okay, into a minus 2b plus 2 vertex subset, which means chromic number of a Kinesi graph is at most A minus 2b plus 2. Thank you for watching.